You know, some things in life which are just not enough. Just like your iPhone storage, it's yeah. always full. No matter how much cloud space you purchase, no matter it is a 256 GB phone or 1 TB phone, yeah. but your storage is always full. And hence, I'm here to help you out with that. Hi guys, what's up? This is me Hardik, and you're watching iGeeks Blog. And today we are going to talk about iPhone storage. If it is full, what we can do about it without losing some data? So, are you ready? Let's get started. First and foremost, delete those unnecessary apps which you have not been using since ages. Trust me, it's not tough at all. Let me walk you through it. It's very easy. Just go to that particular app. Yes, that app which you are not using since ages. Tap and hold on to it. Click on Remove now and then delete the app. Just delete it. See how simple it was. Now I know. I know that you want to have an argument with me that you are unsure about that app right now, and you might just use it in future because you have used it before. Then let me tell you a trick for that. Go to Settings, General, go to iPhone Storage, and then Offload Unused App. Now, mind you, we are not deleting the app; we are just offloading it. That means your data is safe and secure. You can reinstall that app whenever you want, and your data would be there for you. But in the meanwhile, your storage would take a sigh of relief and thank you for it. Now I have said this before. I'll say it again, and I'll be more calm and composed this time. Please, please go and delete your photos and videos. No, God, please, no, no. No! Yes, all those photos and videos that you have kept in your storage, just because you will post one pic someday somewhere, which you are not sure of. So it's very easy. Just go to a gallery, select all those ten thousand unused photos and videos, and delete it. Delete it. Yes, you heard it right. Delete it. Ah, oh, oh, God. Oh god. Then go to albums, open recently delete and delete the pics and videos from there as well. Yes, from there as well. And if this is such a painful activity for you that you are even ready to pay money for it, that you know take the money and take my pain away, then do one thing. Buy some cloud storage. Either it is Apple or Google, just buy some cloud storage, transfer all your data to that cloud and Your storage is empty. Your phone is relieved. Last but not the least, you remember when you were traveling, and that time you downloaded some episodes from your favorite OTT platform, and you thought that you will watch them in the offline mode. Now you got the time, or you did not get the time, but ultimately those episodes are still there in the offline mode, sitting in your OTT. That is consuming space. That is how you clear up your storage. So you go to your favorite OTT platform and delete those episodes from there. That way your storage would be sorted. I hope I was able to help you with your iPhone storage issues. Do let me know in the comment section below which hack did the trick for you. In the meanwhile, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to iGeeks Blog. And if you are a hardcore Apple fan just like us, then don't forget to download the iGeeks app from the App Store.